Well, thank you, guys. Well, you know what? Last year, a group of 15 high school girls from Cape Town, they began a project to launch Africa's first privately owned satellite into space as part of the Meta Economic Development Organization satellite program. Now, in an effort to inspire more young women in South Africa to pursue careers in mathematics and science, the organization will be reaching out to 150 other school girls on Youth Day with the aim to introduce introducing them to the program. And joining us in studio to tell us more about this project is one of the participants, Banakazi Tandwa, as well as the program manager, Carla de Clark. Ladies, welcome to Expresso. Thank you Thank so you. much. It's lovely having you here. And I have to say, you know, uh, Ban Banakazi, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start with you. You are directly involved in the program, in, in the launch of the satellite. What is this, how has this experience been for you? It has been a great experience because um, I've never ex imagined myself um, building things and building satellites and stuff like that. So it was a very wonderful experience and uh, yeah. Ha have you been directly involved? Have you guys launched uh, anything into space yet? No, not yet, but we're planning on to. We um, doing um, some basic practical practice so that uh, when we launch, it will be easier for us to, uh, to be able to to do yes, it. Yes. Oh, fantastic. Now, Carla, as mentioned earlier, on Youth Day, you'll be hosting a workshop for 150 other school girls to introduce them to the main project. Tell us more about what this project entails. So, Youth Day is basically our one year anniversary. Last year on Youth Day, we launched the program. So, this year on Youth Day, we want to do something very big and special to celebrate it. So, we invited this 150 young, young women from around Cape Town to come in to learn to build robots and also learn to program those robots. So we're not only celebrating, but we're also launching new technology, program programmable intelligent robots. Yeah. And because our goal is impact, impacting as many young women as possible, that's why we've decided to work with 150 young women for this one day. I think that's incredible. And you're also emphasizing the focus on, you know, for them to be in the field where they have to use their mathematics and science. Why did you guys decide to specifically focus on young ladies? So it is predicted that by 2020, 80% of all, all careers will be STEM related and will, will require a STEM education. So STEM is a term for science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. And if you look worldwide, less than 14% of all careers, all STEM careers are held by women. And that in, in South Africa, it's less than 7%. So the world is moving towards technology and science and mathematics, but we're finding a gap where young women aren't going into these careers, so they're not contributing to these fields. Okay, and other than, you know, learning about to build a rover, what else can the ladies expect at the workshop? So, they're going to be building a rover. This is actually the rover that we have here. Okay, um, so we, we can show it to camera? Yeah, so it's here and you plug it in and it starts moving around. So, the fun thing is, this is homegrown developed technology that we, we developed ourselves in-house. And the fun thing is, it's essentially like building blocks like Lego. Because you, you plug the circuits, the modules, okay. into, into each other instead of soldering it together. And each time we, we have a workshop, we're planning once a month space-a-thons, space we learn to plug in a new model yeah. and program that. So essentially the rover is going to be able to walk on all two, two legs, hind legs, is going to be looking for, for movement, is going to be following the light. So it's very exciting where it can go to. Yeah, it is extremely exciting. Well, ladies, it was lovely having you on Expresso Show. They're from the Mesa Economic Development Organization Satellite Program. They'll be hosting a, U a workshop on Youth Day for 150 other school girls. Well, it's great what you guys are doing and all the best of luck with your first anniversary coming up. Well, this is your Feel Good Breakfast Show. Let's head on over to Leanne.